Welcome to You Know. NASA Space Probe has issued a startling alert to Earth Voyager 1 has garnered the admiration of science enthusiasts worldwide for its remarkable journey through space initially slated for a five-year mission this resilient spacecraft has defied all expectations. Enduring for nearly five decades now a groundbreaking discovery looms as Voyager 1 has detected unidentified objects passing. Through space what are these mysterious flying objects join us as we delve into how Voyager 1 spotted 300. Unknown object objects traversing space while we marvel at Earth's natural wonders, the majestic waterfalls, towering mountains, and vibrant ecosystems it's sobering to realize our planet is. But a speck in the vastness of space for centuries scientists have pondered the mysteries beyond our solar system. And the vigilant gaze of the sun fortunately Voyager 1 emerged as humanity's boldest endeavor to seek answers to these timeless questions this incredible spacecraft has ventured beyond the reach of. Our most powerful telescopes gathering first-hand data about interstellar space and transmitting it back to Earth. After decades of an incredibly successful journey Voyager 1 has delivered a surprising message that has left scientists astonished. Voyager 1 NASA's most trusted interstellar explorer has just reported detecting 300 unknown objects passing through space. But before we unravel the mystery of these unidentified objects let's first explore one of humanity's most remarkable space. Exploration stories in August 2012 Voyager spacecraft achieved an extraordinary milestone. After an incredible journey Voyager 1 officially reached the outer boundary of our solar system crossing what's called the Helops however. This achievement was far from easy as Voyager 1 moved away from the sun the sunlight available to power its instruments diminished. Significantly its main power source 3. Radioisotope thermoelectric generators convert the heat from plutonium-238 decay into electricity. Over time the declining heat output of the RTGS has reduced available power this decrease affects various onboard systems, including scientific instruments data transmission and communication to conserve energy some non-essential systems, and instruments have been deactivated or put in a sleep mode however. As power continues to decline critical systems may need further optimization or even shutdown to extend Voyager 1's life the reality is without action Voyager 1's ability to function will be severely limited and even if it continues its usefulness may be greatly reduced another challenge is the vast distance between Voyager 1 and Earth as it ventured into interstellar space the signal strength from Voyager 1 weakened considerably currently it takes over 21 hours for signals to travel from Voyager 1 to Earth the weak signal combined with background noise makes successful data transmission and reception challenging furthermore transitioning from the heliosphere to interstellar. Space exposes Voyager 1 to vastly different temperature conditions in the heliosphere it was closer to the S and experienced higher temperatures, but interstellar space brings extremely low temperatures these extremes can impact the spacecraft's materials electronics and Systems thermal stress and temperature changes could potentially affect certain parts structural integrity extreme cold can cause materials to become brittle potentially leading to fractures or degradation of seals and connectors additionally temperature variations can affect the performance of the RTGS which are designed to operate within specific thermal ranges the cooling of the RTGS exacerbates the previously mentioned power challenges compounding these issues is the presence of a sparse distribution of dust particles within interstellar space although minuscule these particles pose a risk to the Voyager 1 spacecraft when the spacecraft encounters interstellar dust collisions with its exterior surfaces, can cause wear and tear on protective coatings, antenna surfaces, or other sensitive areas. The accumulation of dust on the instrument's optics or sensors can interfere with their functionality, degrad the quality of the data collected. Furthermore, NASA's Deep Space Network, a global system of antennas for communicating with deep space missions, must allocate limited resources to receive Voyager 1 signals making communication opportunities much more infrequent than ever before the continuous decrease in signal strength further complicates data retrieval and the transmission of reliable commands the accomplishments of the Voyager twin probes stand as a testament to human ingenuity and the boundless spirit of exploration these remarkable spacecraft launched more than four decades ago embarked on a journey that fundamentally changed our understanding of the distant worlds in our solar system their early observations of Jupiter and Saturn's moon shattered preconceived notions and left. Researchers in all these moons previously thought to be inactive, and skied like our own moon proved to be vibrant and dynamic teeming with geological activity among the Voyager probes Voyager 2. Stands out for its extraordinary milestones in 1986 it made history by becoming the first spacecraft to venture close to Uranus providing humanity with a first up-close look at this enigmatic planet. 
and its moons just three years later bore two accomplished yet another groundbreaking feat with a flyby of Neptune revealing the wonders of this icy giant to this day Voyager 2 remains the sole spacecraft to have ventured into the realms of Uranus and Neptune a testament to its pioneering spirit for the dedicated scientists and engineers involved in this extraordinary endeavor from the very beginning the culmination of, of the Voyager missions is both a moment of pride and a touch of melancholy their unwavering dedication and tireless efforts have far exceeded their initial expectations the wealth of Data returned by the Voyagers has provided invaluable insights fueled numerous scientific discoveries, and sparked the imagination of countless researchers and space enthusiasts what truly distinguishes the Voyager probes is their meticulous design as stable platforms with a rotation, rate over 15 times slower than the hour hand of a clock. These spacecraft were engineered to minimize visual blurring as they captured images and data. While hurtling through the vastness of space even before their encounters with the outer planets their impressive imaging capabilities began to amaze scientists, and the public alike months before reaching Jupiter the Voyager spacecraft began transmitting images of this gas giant captivating. Audiences at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory these early images showcased the mesmerizing swirling clouds and the iconic Great Red Spot. Leaving observers in awe however it was the discovery of active volcanoes on Jupiter's moon Io that truly stole the spotlight this moon, slightly larger than Earth's moon turned out to be the most volcanically active body in our solar system the spacecraft's instruments, detected peculiar signals from Io which were confirmed by the vivid images they captured towering volcanic plumes, and a surface scarred by volcanic material ejections were unveiled peel one of Io's most. Prominent volcanoes has erupted with a force 30 times greater than the height of Mount Everest covering an area nearly the size of France, while the cameras of the Voyager spacecraft were eventually powered down to conserve power and memory before their journey into interstellar space it is worth noting that the photos they captured did not include Mercury and Mars for various reasons in addition to the Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 interstellar probes NASA has also operated other notable spacecraft such as Pioneer 10 Pioneer 11 and New Horizons Voyager 1 passed by Pioneer 10 on February 17, 1998 marking the moment when Pioneer 10 became the most distant spacecraft Voyager 1 continued its solitary voyage for another 14 years before finally entering the interstellar environment on August 25, 2012 although there were no other space probes in sight to catch up with NASA did not publicly announce this remarkable achievement until 2013 adding to the intrigue and wonder surrounding the Voyager. Missions 1 technique that truly shot in the legendary Voyager missions was the gravity assist maneuvers these maneuvers played a crucial role in propelling Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 on their audacious quest to explore the outer reaches of our solar system in order to reach these distant destinations and gathering valuable data the spacecraft needed more than just their own propulsion systems they needed a boost and gravity assists provided just that picture the two intrepid spacecraft Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 embarking on their grand tour of the solar system instead of relying solely on their engines, they engaged in a celestial dance with some of our solar system's heavyweight planets. This intricate choreography allowed them to utilize the immense gravitational pull of these giants to slingshot themselves on their way. By doing so they conserved precious fuel, and gained the velocity required to visit multiple destinations leaving a lasting legacy of exploration and discovery now. Let's delve into the recent mystery of Voyager 1's detection of 300 unknown objects in interstellar space was the detection of 300 unknown objects of malfunction or something far more mysterious as Voyager 1 glides through through space dutifully gathering and transmitting valuable data back to Earth the responsibility of examining this data falls on diligent scientists eager to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos recently amidst the steady stream of information a captivating discovery emerged a signal that perplexed and intrigued researchers around the world Voyager 1 had detected the presence of 300 unknown objects traversing interstellar space these unidentified objects emerging from. The depths of interstellar space posed a profound challenge to our current understanding of the universe when Voyager 1 transmitted information it typically followed a straightforward process however on this occasion the data arrived scrambled and unintelligible numerous questions arose but answers remained elusive curiously despite the peculiar nature of the transmitted data Voyager 1 itself remained unscathed, and continued to operate in remarkable condition its communication link with. Earth remained intact, and the signal retained its strength allowing valuable information to be sent to NASA without significant issues strangely none of the spacecraft's fault protection systems were triggered indicating that it had not entered a protective safe mode, 
As it would in the presence of threats it became evident that Voyager 1 was not under attack leaving scientists. To wonder what could be causing the scrambled or inaccurate telemetry data was it interference from external cosmic phenomena such as radiation or high-energy particles, or could it be attributed to an entirely unknown phenomenon lurking in the depths of interstellar space it was elated that something unusual might have occurred just before Voyager 1 reached the heliosphere, and the natural challenges encountered during that transition could have led to the scrambling of data however it became apparent that Voyager 1 was not in an area where these challenges were concentrated enough to pose a significant threat. Consequently, the team also scrutinized the intricacies of Voyager 1's communication systems investigating potential signal distortions caused by cosmic noise interference, or subtle shifts in its trajectory. The search for answers necessitated a meticulous analysis of all potential factors. The research process was not instantaneous, it spanned several weeks the team employed advanced data processing techniques developed innovative algorithms, and simulated various scenarios to isolate the root cause of the unusual telemetry anomalies this rigorous work finally bore fruit. After months of receiving scrambled data from the spacecraft scientists, and engineers successfully restored the clarity and reliability of the information streaming in from the far reaches of interstellar space nevertheless. The rest of the spacecraft systems remained operational and data collection activities continued unhindered with the source of the problem identified engineers swiftly devised a solution they sent a command to Voyager 1 instructing the OX system to switch to the correct computer for transmitting the telemetry data. Although this fix entailed relatively low risk it required immense patience due to the significant time delay caused by the vast distance. Between Earth and Voyager 1 radio signals took nearly 22 hours to travel back and fourth necessitating precise coordination during the troubleshooting process their efforts exemplified the importance of leveraging past knowledge and combining it with present technology to overcome challenges in space exploration engineers suspect that Voyager 1's deviation into utilizing the non-operational computer was triggered by a faulty command received from another onboard system this hypothesis suggests the presence of an underlying issue. Within the spacecraft's intricate computer network, despite this concern mission managers remain cautiously optimistic emphasizing that the incident does not pose a significant threat to Voyager. One's long-term well-being in fact the resilient probe swiftly recovered from the error and resumed its mission immediately after the correct computers were back online with this triumphant restoration Voyager 1 etched its name in the annals of history by successfully reaching the Helops the boundary marking its entry into interstellar space thanks for watching another episode of You Know. While you're still here click on the other videos you see on your screen right now.